Well, our recent stretch of warmer weather, at least some days, has had us all screaming for ice cream. But we kept our screaming to a minimum, though, when we walked into Blue Cow Ice Cream for today's Tasty Tuesday. I and mean, I think the first thing you notice when you walk into our shop is probably the smell of waffle cones. We wish you had smell vision right now. The smell is incredible inside Roanoke's Blue Cow, where waffle cones are made all day, every day. It's a process I tried to get the hang of right off the bat. Cut up one already. Right. All right, this, this is good. <laughs> this is good. Owner Jason Kaiser was more generous to say that. His journey into the ice cream biz was a unique one. I went to ice cream making school at Penn State. They actually have a, a short course, they call it, and I learned the technology of ice cream production. He schooled us on the method to the madness at Blue Cow. We wanted to have classics that everyone might expect to find in an ice cream shop, and then we wanted to have a little more culinary-driven flavors. And boy, have they succeeded in doing that. Some really interesting flavors like... Goat cheese with blueberry swirl in it. People come in and they don't expect it. They have a little taste of it, and it's kind of like our play on a cheesecake ice cream. He says that ice cream is a very seasonal gig. Right now, winter flavors are flying off the shelves. Chocolate raspberry, which has been a very popular flavor. Candied bacon is out there right now as well. A snickerdoodle through the colder months. As winter comes to a close, finally, we can expect some sweet changes. More berry flavors as we get into the spring. As we run into summer, uh, things like banana pudding and key lime pie. Perfect flavors and a perfect location, too. We have the, the Roanoke Star in the zoo right up the hill, and that's been a great asset for the business, and so has the Greenway. That was this little guy's mindset as he chowed down on some candied bacon while we were visiting. So get a good walk-in and treat yourself to whatever's on the menu when you stop in.